Let's look at how you write, record, and print checks in QuickBooks. Only enter a check into QuickBooks if you're writing or printing an actual check to buy something. Important safety tip. Even if you write checks by hand for your business, you still need to record them in QuickBooks. First, open a check and start typing the payee's name. If this is a new vendor, click Add. Click Details to add their contact info now, or if you're in a rush, click Save. You can add their contact info later on the vendor page. If you've got more than one checking account, choose the one you're using now. Enter the check date, which might not be today's date. Next comes the part that can sometimes be confusing. In Account, choose the category for the item or service you bought. If it was something valuable, like a computer or a car, choose an asset account. If you bought something smaller that will get used up, like printer paper or cleaning supplies, choose an expense account. Then, in the description, you can name and describe the item or service you want. Add the amount for this check. If you want to print a check, click Expenses and then select Print Checks. If you haven't printed QuickBooks checks before, you need to align your paper so everything gets printed in the right place. Choose either Standard or Voucher style checks. Click View Preview and Print Sample. A new window shows you what a sample page of checks looks like. Click Print. The sample numbers on your printout should align with the amount boxes on your checks. If not, that's okay. A lot of printers don't align perfectly on the first try. Click No. Continue Setup. Update your Adobe PDF Reader if you need to and print another sample. If it still needs work, click No. Continue Setup again. To fine-tune your printing, drag and drop the amount grid to match the misaligned numbers on your test checks, not to where you want them to be. Now that your printer's aligned, load some QuickBooks checks into your printer and print out a batch of checks today.